Hello, my name is Ray Gonzalez. I am a nonprofit founder and board member. I'm here today to talk to you about boards and gear brought to you by Washington Nonprofits. Our goal today is to talk to you about boards and how they can help you get your mission out. Now, it doesn't matter what size you are. You could be a large organization, a small organization, working on education, health, the environment, or like what I did, the arts. Our goal today is to talk to you about boards and how they can help you with your mission. Now, I'm here with Nancy Bacon. She is a director of learning from Washington Nonprofits. Hi, Nancy, how are you today? I'm great, it's great to be here it's with you. It's good to have you. Yeah, at Washington Nonprofits, we believe that strong nonprofits make for strong communities. So we work every day to help you have a strong organization so you can better achieve your mission. Washington Nonprofits creates a set of learning tools that you can bring into the life of your organization anytime, whether it be a board meeting, an orientation, or just for your board members to learn on their own. By learning from our experts in these videos, you can make your board stronger to better achieve your mission. Sounds great. So why don't we hear from our experts on why it's important to get your board in gear? Mm -hmm. We should focus on getting our boards in gear because our board members are longing to be strategic governors, compelling ambassadors, and effective fundraisers on our behalf, but our organizations are often in their way. Boards matter because they are the authentic connection for the organization back to the community uh, that supports the nonprofit and that the nonprofit serves. Boards matter because we have to be accountable to the communities we serve, and boards are the mechanism to have linkage and accountability to our communities. Boards matter because they are an extension of your organization, and if you are small, there are extra people out there in the community, and if you're large, they're just great advocates. So they matter a ton to an organization in terms of how they can be an extension of your staff and the volunteers. Boards matter because they are a reflection of the communities that we serve. As nonprofits, we are community-based organizations, and boards allow the communities to become engaged in the organizations that we are a part of. Boards matter because they bring a diversity in perspective, uh, leadership skills, expertise, talents, and this is so important in driving forward the mission of an organization. Boards matter because they serve as advocates, as leaders, and as stewards of organizations that can really make a big difference in our communities. Boards really matter. When my board was organized, they got a grant for the educational programs for adults and kids. Thanks to our experts. Now that we understand why boards matter, how do we tackle this big topic of boards? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, yeah, it's true. Because boards are so complex, we got ourselves in gear and we broke it into five main topics. Connection to cause, responsibilities, composition and development, board operations, and fundraising. Each video segment and kit is broken into the same sections. What you need to know, how you show you know it, key tools, and next steps. We kept the video short because we know that boards have only maybe 10 or 15 minutes to bring new learning into their board. So is it fair to say that you break all this information down into tiny bits so it's easier to digest? Absolutely. This way they can actually improve their board to better achieve their mission. Well, thank you for joining us on Boards and Gear.